All right, guys. Looks like we're gonna have to order food again. We have no good food. Oh, uh, we're gonna starve. Wait, I have something. What about this pickle? And what? <laughs> what did you just pull out a pickle from? I always keep a trusty pickle in my pocket. That is gross. It's probably got like hair and like stuff on it. Oh, come on, just try the pocket pickle. It's not that bad. I, I am not trying your pocket pickle. That sounds disgusting. Come on. Ew! Did you just put it on the floor? That makes it even more gross. It's the floor pocket. Po no, no, it's the floor pocket pickle. Yeah, my dear, you to touch it. You're touching it. You're touching it. Take that. <laughs> you just have to pick it up. It's not that bad. What? Is he scared of the pickle touch? I think, yeah, he has the pickle touch now. Cam, you have the pickle touch. I'm throwing up in the bathroom. <laughs> oh, gosh. Ruby, what was in that pickle? You didn't even eat it. He just touched it. Um, it's just a pickle, but I guess since he's not here, we can decide what we eat. Ooh, okay, okay. We should have, um, ooh, what about some burgers from outside? That could be really good. Wait, uh, Hold on a minute. Did you hear that? Uh, yeah, I did. Did you order pizza or something? Uh, no. I didn't order anything yet. Hold on. Did one of you guys order something, Cam? <laughs> okay, I don't think Cam ordered anything. Wait, Ruby, did you already order food? Um, no, but let's just see what it is. Maybe it's a package. Ooh, all right, all right. Maybe someone already shipped food to us. Here, I guess let me just open up the door. Hello? Is there anyone there? And... <gasps> Wait, there's a note. Hold on a minute. Wait, what does it say? Uh, wait a minute, guys. The first line says, hey, Dashy Poo. What? what? Ew. Wait, is this a prank? It was pranking Dash. Is this one of you guys? Hey, did one of you guys write this prank letter? Kim, was this you when you were upstairs? Did you just drop it from the upstairs window? Dude, no. The, you could go look at your toilet. All of my throw up is still in the toilet, by the way. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, never mind, never mind. This probably isn't you then, but hold on. Let me keep on reading. It says, hey, Dashy Poo, I've had my eye on you these past few days. What does that mean? I don't know, but it's a sick rhyme. Hey, Dashy Poo, I got my eye on you. Wait, maybe they are writing a poem. Hold on, hold on. Let me keep on reading. Let me keep on reading. And then the next part says, and I wanted to say I find you really attractive with three exclamation marks. Oh, wait, guys. I think someone has a crush on me. Oh, they can't rhyme. <laughs> wait, three exclamation points? That's kind of serious. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Wait, wait. Who could this be? Let me keep on reading. At the bottom, it says love anonymous. Wait, what? They're not even going to say who they are anonymous Ooh, they're a secret admirer dash or maybe that's their name maybe their name is anonymous what well, maybe i don't think their name would be anonymous that's kind of a weird name to have but wait a minute guys they must have just been here at our door if they dropped off this book we gotta look for them they gotta be around here hmm. hello anonymous are you anywhere around here hello i i think they're either really good or not here and oh, wait a minute guys hold on i see a walrus over there maybe that's the person who wrote the letter hey walrus are you anonymous dash walruses don't speak english Hey, what if it's like a special walrus? We don't know. And oh, guys, I don't think it's the walrus. It's just like moving its head in and out and stuff. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure walruses can't even like write. Yeah, okay. Maybe it's not the walrus. Ooh, what about the pig over there? Um, it's obviously not that. Wait, what? what's that over there? And wait, what? What? <gasps> wait a minute. There's someone over there. Hey, you. Are you the one who wrote this love letter? Hey, Miss Lady. Hello, hello. Are you the... Wait. What? Did they just disappear? Where did they go? Uh, what, the, hello? Hello? Wait, did they drink an invisibility potion? What's going on? Wait, w why are we levitating? Um, guys, hold on. Was this because of that person down there? What is happening? Let me down! Um, wait, why are we floating? Where are we going? Uh, this is kind of scary. Wait, how long are we going to be levitating for? Guys, we have to try to land into the river if we fall. Okay, okay, but wait, what's that up there? Wait, what's what? And <gasps> Whoa, wait a minute. That stuff wasn't there before. Whoa, what is this stuff? It looks like there's a bunch of hearts over there and then a red plastic. Platform. Let me let's try landing on it. Wait, are we floating into a box? I think so. <gasps> Wait a minute, guys. Maybe this is like a special date set up by that person down there. Maybe if it is, this is kind of crazy. Uh, uh, this is really weird for a date. Wow, yeah, this is a very crazy date. This person is going all out. And whoa, okay, guys, we're in the box. What is this place? Oh, and our levitation just wore off. Uh, I'm so glad to be on the ground again, but I wish I was on dirt instead. But wait a minute, guys. Look, there's an opening in this box, and then there's a bunch of hearts over there. How are we supposed to get to those? Wait, guys, is this an elytra course? And oh, wait, Ruby, are there elytras in the chest? There are. There's like three. Oh, I see what this is. Guys, I think we have to use the elytras to fly through the hearts. And whoa, they set up three elytras. That's so thoughtful of them. It's almost like they knew we were gonna be here. But wait, guys, are we sure this is safe? Yeah, Ruby, I'm sure it's fine. You know, if this person went through all the effort to set this up, surely they can't be bad. Martin means they're crazy. They didn't even ask you. No, we can't leave this person hanging. They just invited Dash to a date. Yeah, guys, I say we just go. You know what? Hold on. I'm going. Let's go. I'm behind you. Whee! Whoa, wait. Okay, guys, we have to fly through all of the hearts. This is actually sick. Whoa. 
Whoa, wait, I'm going so fast. Whoa, okay, hopefully I don't crash into any of these hearts. Everyone, be super careful. This is a really cool lecture course. I'll give them at least that. Whoa, wait, guys, hold on. I think we made it to the end. Look, there's a big heart in the mountain over here. Whoa, okay, perfect. I landed. I crashed into the wall. Oh, gosh, wait, Ruby, did you not make it? I'm right here. Look behind you. Oh, 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 you made it. Okay, well, that works, but whoa, guys, hold on. What is this place now? <gasps> there's a chest. Hold on, what's inside of it? Another note. Oh, uh, is this going to be a love letter like the last one? I don't know. I guess let's see. I kind of want to meet this person again. We only saw them for like a second last time. And okay, it says hello again, Dash, with like three L's in the hello. Um, maybe they don't know how to spell. But then it says glad you came. Before we can meet, though, you need to train your hacker skills to become a hacker like me. And wait, what? They're a hacker? That explains the mask. Oh, yeah. They did kind of have like a weird mask on their face when we saw them. Wait, guys, aren't hackers bad? I don't know. I guess this one's nice. Some of them can be good. Um, Okay, we'll keep on reading the letter then. All right, all right. It says hackers and non-hackers can't date and then love anonymous. Huh, I didn't know that. I think we're gonna turn Dash into a hacker so he can date a hacker. Whoa, I'm gonna turn into a hacker? That sounds awesome. I wish I would've become a hacker. That seems so cool. Well, guys, we're all here. Maybe we're all gonna become hackers, but wait a minute, guys. I think we have to go down these stairs. The letter said you need to train your hacker skills to become a hacker like me. Maybe there's like a little hacker training course down here. Oh, yeah, it shouldn't be anything uh, too difficult like x-ray and uh, i don't know what else do hackers do i don't know but i guess let's check it out and whoa okay this place looks pretty fancy and oh oh guys there's some signs over here it says for your first training you must learn reach break the trees from behind the fence and wait uh wait we have to break the trees from behind the fence what How, from over here this is impossible yeah you can't reach this far wait wait hold on is there like another fence behind the trees that we need to go to is there any other fence here hello and Okay, uh, guys, I think that's the only fence. I think we have to literally break those trees from all the way back here. Oh, well, I guess we have to go home because you can't do this. Wait, no, 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 I've got an idea. Anybody have any TNT? What? No, Kim, Kim, we're not using TNT. We're not using TNT, but, hmm, how are we supposed to do this? She didn't even leave any, like, tips and drinks. Yeah, this person really isn't the best teacher. Uh, uh, uh guys? What, Kim, how are you in the wall? What, did you turn into a hacker? I, I, no, I, I was leaning against the wall and I fell through. Whoa, what the heck? And, oh, wait a minute, guys, there's a chest. Here. Hold on, hold on. We gotta check this out. <gasps> There's another note. Wait, guys, maybe this is like a, a secret trick on how to actually do the training. We'll take the note and let's get out because it's cramped in there. Okay, okay, yeah, let's take a look. Let's take a look and... <gasps> Guys, the note says, hey, with a smiley face. I see you found the tip for this room. Guys, I was right. It's like a tip. Let's go. Ooh, let's go. What does it say? It says, to break the wood, you need to start punching and think really, really hard about the tree breaking and then love anonymous. What? Okay, well, that, that's still kind of like hard. You just have to think really hard about the tree breaking. No way that's actually going to work. Well, here, I guess I'm just going to try it out and... Uh, wait, guys, hold on. I I think it actually worked. Did you just see that? I just broke that log from all the way here. Wait, how did that work? That was actually awesome. Whoa! Okay, wait, wait, hold on. Can I do that again? I want to try it on this tree over here. No way. That's not going to work again, is it? Hold on. I'm going to break this log right over here. Let me just keep on punching and thinking really hard about it. Come on in. Oh, oh, it worked. Do you guys see that? That was sick. All right, I just got to think really hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's all you got to do. And Oh, no, dude. I think you were thinking hard about the wrong thing. I'll be right back. That is <laughs> um, okay, well, Ruby, do you want to give it a go? Um, after seeing that, no thank you. Oh, all right, fair enough. But anyways, I think that's the first training course done. Let's go. And guys, check it out. There's a door over here. I'm guessing we have to go through this to get to the next training course. Maybe we can meet the person after this. Let's just pull up and... <gasps> Whoa, wait a minute. It looks like there's parkour over here. Guys, I think we just have to do this parkour. Wait, what? That looks pretty easy. Yeah, it's just pretty simple. And yeah, guys, this kind of just looks like normal parkour. This doesn't look like anything hacker themed. Here, I guess let me go for the first jump. Let's go. And uh, wait, did I just fall through the jump? <gasps> I gotta use my elytra. I gotta use my elytra. And <gasps> guys, I made it to the end. Oh my gosh, that was crazy. I think what we have to do is use our elytra. The parkour was a trick. Um, I don't think that first block was real. Yeah, I just fell through it. Did you guys see that? And oh, oh, okay, Ruby, you learned from my mistakes. You didn't even jump in the lava. That was good. Okay, and I'm here. Cam, get over here. This parkour has to be possible, guys. Come on. Cam, I don't think it's possible. Didn't you just see me fall through that block? Hmm, maybe we just have to jump on the second block. But, Cam, I don't think you can jump on the second block from where you're standing right now. <sighs> Yeah, it's not happening. Yeah, uh, I think the electro was what we had to do. All right, but anyways, I guess let's keep on going down. It looks like there's a ladder over here. All right, what is this next training room? And ooh, guys, there's a lever and a sign. I love having levers and signs in big rooms. It says, flick lever to start combat training. Ooh, guys, it's combat training. I don't know. I, we don't have any weapons. 
weapons. Yeah, are we supposed to fight with our fists? And yeah, guys, we have to hack on whatever we're gonna be trading combat on. Hold on, should we flick the lever? Is everyone ready? Um, this is your training. I don't want to do it. Yeah, we don't really know how to do combat hacking yet. We don't even know how to hack. What? Okay, well, guys, I'm sure we'll figure it out mid-battle. Let me just flick the lever and start this combat training real quick. And oh, guys, there's a million zombies. There's a million zombies. Beat them up. Beat them up. Oh, my God. Um, I don't know. I think I'm the one getting beat up here. No, no Ruby, just turn around and start fighting them. These zombies are super slow. We got this. And oh, wait, guys, maybe we can use the fireworks on them. Yeah, take that, zombies. Boom. That's not doing a thing. No, no, no. It's doing a thing. It's doing a thing. Dash, you're only being chased by one zombie. Look at me. Oh, uh, wait, hold on, Ruby. I'll help you. Don't worry. I'm just pulling up over here and beating up these zombies. Let's go. Okay, but the, where did the hacks come in? I don't know. The person never told us how to do combat hacks. I don't know. Maybe there's another clue around here. Um, uh, yeah, guys, look in the walls. Look in the walls. Is there any clues? Come on. <gasps> I'm looking around all the walls. Kim, you just looked through the walls and you fell through randomly, right? Yeah, that's what happened. Uh, okay, okay. I'm just going to keep on looking around. Any hacker clues? Okay, guys, I don't think there's any clues. Okay, so then I guess we're just going to die. No, no, guys, we got this. It's only a few zombies, okay? I think this is just normal combat training. No hacks involved. Yeah, maybe we just have to fight all these zombies normally. And Oh, no, I'm at half a heart. I'm at half a heart. Um, oh, do you want a pickle? No, Ruby, I'd rather stay at half a heart than eat that pickle. Uh, see yourself. I'm going to eat it. That is so gross. Did you really just eat it? Yep, because eating this pickle is the only thing keeping me alive right now. What the heck? Okay, okay, well, let's just keep on fighting these guys. Come on, there's only a few zombies left. Oh, my God, they're so annoying. <gasps> Come on, zombies, you're going down. We're going to get you. This is the worst combat training ever. It is a weird date. I have to do combat training in the middle of the day. I haven't even met the person yet. I don't even know if this is a date. I think this is just your training. I mean, they did say that hackers and non-hackers can't train, but anyways, there's only a few zombies left. Come on, we just got to beat up these last few zombies, and then we should be good to go. Okay, come on. Oh, no, I'm up one heart. Watch out, watch out. I'm at half a heart. But wait, guys, come on. There's only one zombie left, and boom. There we go. We got him, finally. Uh, worst date ever. What? Okay, well, Ruby, it could turn around. Maybe this person just wanted to test if I know how to fight zombies before we could meet. Um, sure, but that's not in my dating criteria. What? Okay, well, maybe this person just wanted someone, like, really strong and buff like me. Yeah, sure. Let's just move on to the next room, and it's made out of bedrock. But, oh, guys, check it out. There's a chest at the end. Maybe there's another note inside of it. Let me check. And yes, I was right. There's another note. Wait, what does it say? Let me take a look. It says, good job, Dashy Poo, on completing the hacker training. Ooh, let's go. We completed it. Yeah. Why does she keep on calling you Dashy Poo? I don't know. I guess they just must really like me. But hold on. There's more. There's more. It says, before we can meet, I need to do a quick test to see if you didn't cheat on the training. What? Uh, of course we didn't cheat. How would we cheat on the training? Yeah, I'm pretty sure we did. And we done everything how we were supposed to. Yeah, exactly. We're going to pass this test. No problem. And wait, what's going Going on? Wait, guys, hold on. We're, we're inside of cobwebs. We're slowly falling inside of cobwebs. Does anyone have any blocks? Um, no, I don't have any blocks. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Um, okay, well, hold on a minute. How do we get out of this? It looks like we're slowly falling into a bedrock box, but <gasps> there's a chest over there. Maybe we can use something from there to get out. Maybe there's some blocks in there? Um, maybe. Oh, gosh. Well, it looks like there's no going back now. We're literally stuck down here. Ow, that kind of hurt. My inventory just got cleared, guys. And, wait, wait, hold on a minute. So did mine. I don't have my elytra and firework rockets anymore. What? Oh, no, those are so useful. Oh, gosh. I think the hacker person cleared us. Well, hmm, let's see. Where are we right now? It looks like we're just in a bedrock box, but wait, there's another note here. We gotta read it. It says, have fun in this puzzle room. I hope you don't get too stuck, Dashy Poo. What the heck? What the heck? You, she keeps on calling you Dashy Poo. But wait, they put us in a puzzle room? They really expect us to get out of here? Oh gosh, well, um, hopefully we can escape. It's a puzzle, right? Puzzles are solvable. Yeah, we gotta start solving this. It looks like there's an exit up there. Yeah, but wait, hold on. There's also a big opening over here. Maybe we have to go through here and, oh, Wait, guys, hold on. Every time you go here, you get blindness, I think. What the heck? Oh, it's a blind maze. Hmm. Wait, what? This is a maze? Oh, my gosh. We have to solve it while being blind? And there's all kinds of, like, trinkets and random items in this chest. And, oh, yeah, right. The chest. I completely forgot about that. What's inside of this? And... Oh, no. This is the most random stuff I've ever seen. There's only one block which we can use. Yeah, all of this looks pretty useless. Oh, my gosh. And wait, hold on. There's also a furnace over here. Is there anything useful in this? And, okay, guys, the furnace is just empty. Why is it even here, then? I don't know. This is so random. But wait a minute. Hold on, guys. We actually have more blocks than just this dirt path over here. We've got this crafting table and this chest. We can pick them up. Oh, true. Okay, I got it. All right, all right, perfect. I guess let's go ahead and start making a tower over here. I'm pretty sure we just have to get up to the top of this exit. But hold on. We should also check the maze. Maybe there's an exit inside of here as well. Maybe. Um, it, We're blind, so I don't think we should stick together. Uh, I guess we can only go right. Yeah, yeah. Okay, let's go this way. Let's see. Where are we supposed to go? Oh, this is a dead end. We got to go this way. Oh, I'm going to go this way and that way and this way and that way. Oh, gosh. Hopefully, we don't get lost in here. We do have blindness. Oh, I found a furnace. 
this with um pressure plates? And wait, wait, you did? Hold on a minute. That could be useful. <gasps> Two jungle pressure plates. Okay, okay. Well, uh, that's progress. We could use that for something maybe. Okay, should I leave the furnace here? Uh, I guess so. I don't really know what else we can do with it, but hold on a minute, guys. We got to keep exploring the maze. <gasps> I found something else. Guys, check it out. It says viewing lobby over here, and there's a hopper and a grindstone. And there's more blocks in the hopper. Let's go. I can see. And wait, look down there. Wait, what? Down where? What's going on? And <gasps> there's a dripstone. Okay, that's kind of useless though. Wait, there's invisible blocks here. We can't really get to it. Yeah. Wait, what are we supposed to be viewing here? This is boring. Yeah, th this isn't a very good viewing lobby. But guys, guys, we have more stuff. We can grab this sign over here. We're not going to need that. And hold on a minute. Can we grab the hopper? Yeah, let's grab that. And let's also grab the stone cutter. Oh, we can't grab the stone cutter, unfortunate. Yeah, it's fine. Let's just leave it here for now. Now we got to find our way back. Hmm, pretty sure it's this way. Yeah, okay. I don't think there's any exit in this maze. I think the only exit is that two block hole in the main room. Yeah, so far I haven't seen an exit. And, oh, there we are. We're back in the main room. But anyways, how many blocks now do we have to get up? We've got one, two, three. And then we've also got the stuff inside of the hopper and inside of the chest. But hmm, we should be really careful with our blocks. We don't want to waste anything. Oh, wait, can we use this thing? And wait, what, what, what thing? <gasps> the lectern. You're right. We can use the lectern. Okay, okay. Let's grab the lectern. There's going to be clutch. And <gasps> there's another block underneath it. Let's go. Yo. All right, all right. Let's grab that. Let's grab that. We also have an item frame now that we could use. But guys, this is literally the most random arrangement of blocks ever. What are we supposed to do with all this to make it all the way up? Uh, I don't know. We, we've only got like three blocks plus Ruby's furniture. Hmm, wait, I'm gonna grab the furnace from the maze, too. Oh, yeah, yeah, that sounds like a good idea, but, hmm, okay, how are we supposed to do this? We still are, like, only halfway there. Oh, I have the furnace! And, oh, oh, okay, perfect, perfect, just put it down right over here. We are, like, halfway there still, but, hmm, what are we supposed to do with these blocks? Yeah, take a look at this chest, tell me if you see anything that we're supposed to do. And, oh, wait a minute, guys, hold on, hold on, I know something we can do. Guys, we can make mud with this water bottle and the dirt pack! Ooh, all right, how's that gonna help us? I don't know, but we can do it, should we try? I don't know. I don't think we should just, like, choose something and just go with it. We're limited on resources. Well, Cam, do you have any better ideas? The mud might be our best option here. Uh, no, I don't really have any better ideas, but still, guys. All right, well, guys, in that case, everyone in favor of going with the mud? Yeah, come on, mud time! All right, all right, it's about to get muddy, let's go! But, <gasps> wait a minute, guys, you know what else we can do with this mud? We can make clay! Uh, okay, how do we do that? Well, pretty much, if you put a mud block on top of a dripstone, it'll turn into clay over time. Guys, remember how there was a piece of dripstone inside of the maze? Oh, yeah, I remember that. Wait, wait, how is that gonna help us? I don't know, but I'm guessing this is what we're supposed to do. I don't know what else we're supposed to do. Okay, I guess we have to go look for the dripstone now. And yeah, yeah, can you guys go inside of the maze, look for the dripstone, and then uh, I'll look for your name tag so we can line up. Um, it looks like the dripstone's on you. And wait, wait, hold on. What do you mean on me? Am I, like, standing on top of it right now? Pretty sure, yeah. If you place it down, water should start dripping from it. Okay, okay, so should I just make the mud exactly where I'm standing? Yeah, 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 try it. All right, all right, let me just go ahead and turn this dirt path into a normal dirt real quick and then if i put it down and put the water bottle on top of it boom there we go we got mud now in a few seconds it should turn into clay hopefully um dash how long is this gonna take and <gasps> wait it worked it just turned into clay let's go wait that is awesome really that worked yep and now we've got one clay block this is actually sick and ooh, wait uh guys i kind of just turned that clay block into four clay balls uh what were we supposed to do that uh were we wait hold on let's look at our items what can we do with four clay balls i guess we could just turn them back into a clay block, but oh, wait a minute. I have a better idea. Guys, why don't we make a brick with this clay ball? Okay. What can we do with the brick? If we have a brick, then we could use the stone cutter in the other room to turn it into slabs, and then we could get two of them. Wait, that's two blocks? That's awesome. Yeah, but I'm not sure that's enough to get all the way up there. Well, it's progress. It's progress, all right? And remember, we still got these moss blocks as well, but um, hmm, guys, the first step in turning clay balls into bricks is smelting them. We need to smelt them inside of the furnaces, but uh, wait a minute, guys. What should we use to smelt it? We don't have a lot of stuff here. Wait, can we use the campfire? And, ooh, wait, good idea, good idea. I guess let's try that. Let me grab the clay balls from the furnace real quick. I guess let's just put the campfire down, and all right, it's time to get the clay ball in. Yeah, uh, I'll put the campfire down there. All right, all right, perfect. Let me put the clay balls in, and wait, uh, guys, you can't put clay balls in a campfire. Wait, I have an idea, I have an idea. Wait, what is it? What about these pressure plates? And, ooh, good idea, good idea. We can use the two pressure plates. All right, here, let's put the pressure plates inside of this furnace here, and then also the clay balls. Boom, there we go. And, all right, guys, check it out. We are now smelting the clay balls. Okay, come on, come on, let's go. Hopefully this is enough fuel to actually smelt everything. And oh gosh, guys, uh, the fuel is kind of running low. Wait, we have one brick. Come on, come on, do the second one. Come on, come on, fuel just lasts a little bit longer. We have one brick so far. Okay, uh, there we go, two bricks. Come on, two more. Guys, I don't think this is gonna last. Uh, no, 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 come on, come on. We got this, we got this. And 
Oh, no. The fuel did not last. Guys, we only got three bricks from that. We need to put another fuel source in, but what? Oh, my gosh. Let's see. Um, Let's look at the chest again. All right, all right. Is there anything in here that we could use? And oh, Wait, guys. What about the suspicious stew? We can use the bowl from the suspicious stew as fuel. Oh, yeah. That could work. Wait, we can? Yeah, and wait a minute, guys. Don't you remember? Suspicious stew gives you a random effect every time you drink it. What if it gives us jump boost? Then we'll be able to make the jump no problem. Um, I don't think that it'll do that. Well, should we try it? Should I drink it? There's only one way to find out. All right, here we go. I'm gonna drink it. Hopefully, it doesn't give me a bad effect. And oh no, guys, it gave me weakness. Oh. Um, yeah, it is suspicious too. But anyways, now we have the bowl. Let's go. But wait, guys, hold on. Is one bowl gonna be enough to smelt this clay ball over here? At least we have the bowl. I don't think so. Uh, wait, there's another one in this hopper. Ooh, wait, there's another suspicious too. Okay, well, who wants to drink it this time? I'm not doing that. All right, I guess I'll do it. All right, here we go. What effect are you gonna get? What did you get? I got weakness again. Oh gosh. All right, but hold on a minute. Now that we've got two bowls, I'm pretty sure we can put them both in the furnace, and now it should start smelting the clay ball. Hopefully, this is enough fuel to actually smelt it. And okay, okay, I think we're gonna make it. Come on, just last a little bit longer and... Yes, that was perfect. Now we have four bricks. Let's go. And guys, you know what we can do with four bricks? We can go into our crafting table here and turn them into some bricks. And now if we head over to the stone cutter in the maze, we can turn it into slabs. Let's go. Now all we have to do is find that stone cutter again. Yep, but let's go, guys. We just turned one block into two blocks. And oh, the stone cutter is right over here. Let me go ahead and craft those slabs really quick. There we go. Boom. And all right, perfect. Now let's head back. I think we should have enough blocks now. Yeah, this should be enough to get get us up hopefully yeah i want to get out of this room already yeah let's just go i'm pretty sure we have to go this way there we go and okay yeah guys we are super super close although um we should probably kind of stack this tower going up to the hole not uh sideways we gotta move some of this stuff we gotta move this whole staircase a little bit to the left over here all right i'm moving all the items all right nice i just gotta grab this furnace over here i can't grab it for some reason I gotta grab it from the bottom oh there you go you got it and all right now we just gotta move this campfire and uh, wait, guys, you can't move the campfire. Oh, no, we have to break it. Oh, gosh, I'm pretty sure when you break a campfire, they only drop, like, two pieces of coal. Okay, this is gonna be useless. Do we just take the L? I guess. Oh, gosh. All right, well, rest in peace, campfire. We're gonna have to break it. GG's and... Wait a minute, guys, hold on. It didn't drop coal, it dropped soul soil. I guess it was because it was one of those blue campfires. Oh! No, let's go! We just turned a half block into a full block. Okay, that is actually clutch. Now let's go ahead and just place our last few blocks over here. We gotta put the soul soil there, and then we gotta put these moss blocks here. Wait, wait, hold on. Should we use these moss blocks? What if they are useful? Um, I don't know what moss blocks can do, do you? Wait, hold on. How many more blocks do we need to get to the top? Uh, one, two, three, four, uh, five. Oh, no, hold on. You have one moss block, right? I've got one moss block and two brick slabs. We've only got four blocks right now. Well, is there anything we can do with the moss blocks like you said? Uh, let's see. Hold on. Wait, Cam, hand me your moss block real quick. I'm gonna check all the crafting recipes. Maybe there's something that we can craft with this. Let me see. And... <gasps> Guys, we can craft moss carpet. We can craft three moss carpet. Ooh, all right, let's do it. All right, everyone, let's craft the moss carpet. Boom, there we go. And okay, now we should have exactly five blocks. Let's go ahead and place a few more of our blocks over here like that. We can have our brick slabs there. There we go. And now we got to place the moss carpets. But uh, guys, uh, we kind of got to place them and then like jump on top of them. So everyone get on the moss block. We got to jump at the same time. Okay. All right, everyone, let's jump in three, two, one. Jump, come on, come on. We got to place this moss block underneath us. And oh, that didn't work. Oh, no. Okay, hold on. Let's try one more. Let's try one more. We just got to time our jumps perfectly. Everyone ready? Yeah. All right, all right. Let's go in three, two, one. Come on, go, go, go. And uh, guys, we are way out of sync. Okay, hold on, hold on. Everyone stop jumping for a second. D d try to jump in the same pattern as me. All right. All right, all right. This is looking uh, decent. Let's try placing this moss. And oh, we got it. We got it. Okay, perfect. Now we just got to place this last moss block over here. Keep on jumping, everyone. Let's go. And oh, we made it. Let's go. Finally, Ruby, go first. Okay, I'm here. I'm here. All right, all right. Now, Cam, you and let's go. We escaped the first room. Out. Oh, are you kidding me? Gosh. Okay, well, hold on. I can just place the moss carpet back. Okay, there we go. That worked, but let's go. We just beat the puzzle. That was way too easy. Now, can I finally meet whoever this person is? And oh, no, guys. I think there's another puzzle. Ow, who just pushed me off? Oh, wait, what's down there? Uh, let me see. Well, there's a little bit of glazed terracotta over here. And then there's also a furnace over here with a cauldron inside of it. Oh, I get it. We're supposed to use the cauldron as a toilet. What? No, 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 no. That's not what we're supposed to do. But wait a minute, guys. We can break this glazed terracotta over here. Maybe there's something underneath it. Let's get to breaking. But wait, um, are you sure? I mean, I don't know what else we're supposed to do in this room. And oh, guys, there's a hopper underneath it. I was right. I was right. Check it out. There's a hopper with a singular blaze rod inside of it. Ooh, do you think 
there's more hoppers? Uh, maybe. Let's keep on breaking them. Maybe there's more stuff underneath this glazed terracotta. I mean, there are nine glazed terracotta blocks here after all. Oh, man, I wish I had a pickaxe. I don't know what this thing over here is, but there's nothing. Oh, gosh. Wait, here, Cam. Just pull up and help us break these blocks. <gasps> Wait, guys, I found something else. I don't know what this is. Can I break it? Oh, I'm pretty sure that's called, like, a, a deep roots or something. Can I break it with my fist, do you think? M maybe. I'm pretty sure you can. Ooh, I found the rock. Wait, wait, hold on. You found a rock? What? <gasps> you found a singular piece of dripstone. Okay, nice. That could be useful. And, oh, Ruby, I don't think there's anything underneath that one. We can kind of see. Okay, and um, this is all that we have from the terracotta. Yeah, okay. We got a singular piece of dripstone. We got one of these deep root things, and we got a hopper with a blaze rod inside of it. Okay, well, hmm, is there anything else inside of this room? Cam, are you sure you double-checked this thing good? Yeah, I checked that thing really good, but... Oh, I get it. Wait, look at this. There's lava dripping down. And wait, wait, what? <gasps> lava. Whoa. Okay, what are we supposed to do with that? We have a dripstone in a cauldron, right? If we put the dripstone up there, we can drip lava into the cauldron and collect the lava. Wait a minute. You're right. Maybe we have to burn ourselves into the lava to escape. Um, no, I don't think you're supposed to burn yourself with the lava. I, well, first, let's get it set up. And yeah, okay, first, let's get it set up, and then we'll find out what we have to do with it. Let's go ahead and grab this dripstone over here, and then we also got to grab the cauldron from this furnace. And now, if we place the cauldron and dripstone right underneath the lava, we should start collecting it. Wait, is the lava right here? Yeah, this exact block. All right, all right, hold on. Move out of the way, move out of the way. Let me just place down the dripstone. Boom, there we go. And now, if we place the cauldron underneath it, we should start getting some lava. This might take a while, though. Yeah, maybe we should start taking a look around uh, while we do that. Yeah, that seems like a good idea. And, uh, wait, guys, did you just see that? Hold on, a hole just opened up in the wall. What the heck is that? <gasps> I see it. Wait, it only opens for a few seconds. Wait, how did it open? How did we just do that? Mm, I don't know. Oh, Ruby, you, you opened it. Hold on, I think it opens whenever you go near the lava over there. Hold on, Kim, did you just go in? Yeah, there's some stuff over here. You should come in, too. I'm going in, I'm going... Oh, oh, I didn't get let in. Wait, Ruby, can you open it again? I don't know what I'm doing. Is it like a... Uh, 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 you open it for a second, you open it for... Oh, I mean, let's go! Wait, does this mean that I can't go in? Uh, yeah, wait, Ruby, I think you're stuck out there. Oh, man. Go find your thingy. But wait, hold on. What's inside of this room? We have another hopper with wheat, chorus fruit, and wheat. And then we also have a pressure plate here. What does this do? Oh, it just opens up the door. Oh, wait, Ruby, you can come in. Wait, let me in. Let me in. Let's go. Psych. Oh, I was going to close it on you, but that didn't work. Aw, uh, you, you, you're a little trolly. But uh, the, wait, we got a chorus fruit, right? And yeah, yeah, we have a chorus fruit, wheat, and uh, another piece of wheat. Hmm, what are we supposed to do with all this? Does this mean that we're not going to start? And what? No, 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 Ruby. I don't think we're supposed to eat the chorus fruit. I'm pretty sure we have to save it for something else. Hmm, what can we do with chorus fruit in here? <gasps> wait, you said you got a blaze rod, right? Yeah. I'm pretty sure we can use a chorus fruit and a blaze rod to craft end rods. <gasps> wait a minute. You're right. We can craft some end rods. That should take us like halfway up the wall. Okay, okay, let's do that. I'm pretty sure the blaze rod was inside of this hopper over here. So let's grab that and wait, hold on. Uh, does anyone have a crafting table? N no, you don't need a crafting table. You just need to smelt the chorus fruit. Oh, wait a minute. You're right. You're right. We need to smelt it. But hmm, what are we going to smelt it with? We can't really smelt it with the blaze rod because we kind of need that. <gasps> wait a minute. What about this? The roots. And wait, hold on. We can use the roots. <gasps> let's do it. I guess there's no other need for the roots. Let's put it inside of the furnace like that. Boom. There we go. And all right, guys, now the chorus fruit is smelting. We should get a popped chorus fruit after this. Yeah, it looks like it's enough fuel. Oh, yeah, this is going to be more than enough fuel. But now that we've got the popped chorus fruit, we should be able to turn this into some end rods. Boom, there we go. We got four end rods. That should take us like halfway up this wall. Ooh, wait, are we going to build a little parkour for it? Yeah, yeah, we got to build a little end rod parkour over here like that. There we go. And okay, nice. We're halfway up. Uh, guys, how are we supposed to get another four blocks? I don't know. Does the end rod explain whatever this is? Um, No, not really. This is just like, I, I don't think this is anything. Are you sure? Why would it be here for no reason? Maybe it's a distraction. Ooh, what if I'm supposed to grab you and throw you as hard as I can at the top of the uh, bedrock? Uh, up there? That sounds like I'll get a concussion. I don't think that's the way. Oh, are you guys really trying that? Throw me! Do you see anything? Do you see anything? Uh, that's, you guys, see anything? that's not gonna work. That's not gonna work. Put it down, put it down, put it down. Okay, guys, we gotta think strategically here. We gotta work smarter, not harder, all right? Okay, that means we should all stack on each other, right? No, no, no. It doesn't mean we should all stack on each other, but hmm, what can we do with the resources that we have? Wait, guys, we can take the hopper in the furnace. And, ooh, wait, you're right, you're right. We can use the hopper and the furnace as building blocks. I guess let's pull up over here and put down the hopper like that. Boom, there we go. And all right, Ruby, now we got to put the furnace up there. There we go. Oh, Ruby, can you do whatever you did over there to open the door? Oh, um, I don't really know what I did. Did I do this? Ooh, wait, hold on a minute. There was another hopper in that room, right? And I can't get out. But once we place this, we should get really close. Let's go, but hold on a minute. Uh, there's kind of a small issue. We can't really uh, get up from the end rod. I think what we have to do is build a tower with the end rods, not a park core jump. We have to place them up in a tower like this. There we go. Now we can get up and now we can place these blocks over here like that. Boom. But uh, 
Wait, guys, we're still one block short. We need to get one more block. Hmm. Time to use our brains. What do we do? Oh, gosh, guys. If we didn't put that cauldron down, we could have used it. Well, we already did it, so we have to think about something else now. Hmm. Okay, okay. Well, we've got some end rods, some hoppers, and also a furnace. Is there anything we could do with that stuff? Hmm. Oh, wait. Look, our lava filled up. And wait, wait. Actually, <gasps> let's go. We've now got a cauldron of lava, but what are we going to do with this? Just, like, jump in and, like, enjoy the hot tub? Yeah, we don't have a bucket. No, no, no. I'm pretty sure whenever you take fire damage, you jump higher. And, oh, wait a minute. You're right, guys. Whenever you're burning, you jump like half a block higher. I'm pretty sure that's what we have to do to make it to the end. Wait, what? That's kind of weird. Well, only one way to find out. And, oh, oh, he's going in. Hold on. I want to join him. I want to join him. Let me in. I'm going for a dip in. All right, let's go. Oh, no. Does this mean I have to do it too? Let's go, guys. We're getting lit. And wait, Cam, is it working? Yeah, look at how high I'm jumping. <gasps> let's go. Let's go. You kind of got to like time your jumps. And oh, oh, I just jumped like super high right. there, but Wait, I messed up. It didn't work, did it, huh? Nope, I gotta go back in. Oh, time to... Oh, gosh. Is it even possible to do a two-block jump like this while being lit on fire? Oh, look, look, look. Did you see that? Wait, hold on. You actually almost made it there. This is just insanity. <gasps> Wait a minute, guys. I have an idea. What if we just go ahead and move this hopper over here up a block? Normally, we can't make this jump, but if we're lit on fire, we probably can. And we can just move this entire little staircase up one block. We gotta move that hopper up, and then we also gotta move this furnace up. Excuse me. I'd like to try the block. Well, oh, Kim, I'm not done with the staircase yet. Okay, I you, go, go, go. You do it. Is it working? Is it working? Yeah. Oh, I'm Hold on. I want to try that. Let me go over here in the lava. I bet I can do it. Let me just hop in and... All right. I'm going. I'm going. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, my gosh, guys. This hurts to watch. This is going to work. We're going to get it eventually. Come on. Just punch me up a little bit higher lava already. I'm just going to punch you. Oh, yeah. Ruby, punch me. That might work. That might work. Why is this not working? I think we're just killing you. Hold on. Let me give it a shot. Oh, my gosh. Can we not use the dripstone as a stair? And wait. Actually, hold on. Ruby, you might be right. We might be able to use the dripstone. Hold on. We got to pick it up. Let me grab this dripstone over here real quick. Oh, guys! And wait, Kim, did you make it? <gasps> what? I did it! What the heck? Okay, okay, well, hold on. Now I want to make it, too. It's possible. Let me pull up over here and just put down the dripstone like that. Oh, you can't put the dripstone on the floor, but I guess if Cam did it, it's possible without the dripstone. Come on. Oh, I didn't make it. I'll wait here for you guys. It's actually quite easy. You just gotta time your jump. Okay, okay. Come on, come on. Let me just time my jump. Ugh. Oh, no. I have to set myself on fire again. Yeah, Ruby, this seems like it's the only way. Come on! Uh, 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 let me up, let me up. Oh, gosh, my fire went out. You've got to time it so the fire, like, hits you as soon as you, like, jump. Okay, I see, I see. Here, let me just try doing that. Oh, this is kind of hard. It's hard, but it's definitely possible. I got it! Oh, gosh, my fire keeps unlighting. Come on, come on. And, oh, oh, it worked, it worked! Did you guys see that? It actually worked! Let's go! All right, all right, that was awesome. All right, Ruby, now you got to make it. Okay. Come on, come on, you just got to time it right. Okay, come on. Here we go, and oh! Oh, you got it! You got it! Let's go! And, okay, perfect. Now we all made it to the next level, but... Whoa, uh, guys, there's another big bedrock box. What in the world is this? What is this? Whoa, wait, there's an armor stand and a pig and an end portal. What the heck? Oh, gosh. Well, here, let's take a look at all of the stuff that we have in this room. We've got a furnace with uh, absolutely nothing inside of it. And then we've got a pig and we've got an armor stand with some enchanted gold armor with... Uh, guys, take a look at this enchanted gold armor real quick. What? It's got enchantment levels 255. It's got like every enchantment on it. Wait, that's crazy. Okay, well, that's kind of OP, but... Hmm, what are we supposed to do here? It looks like there's a hopper over there and an end portal. <gasps> Wait a minute, guys. Hold on. There's a tunnel here. We can't go through that tunnel, but you know who can? The piggy? Yep. Mr. Jared over here. He's got a name. Gerard? 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 Yeah, I think it's Gerard, not Jared. Gerard? All right. Well, anyways, Gerard, can we can we go in, please? Is that, you want to you wanna go? Uh, I, I, don't, I don't think he's going. You need a carrot on a stick if you want to lead him. Wait, 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 wait. Guys, guys. Wait, what? Wait, what? What's that? There was a carrot on a stick in the first room. I picked it up. And, oh, wait, you picked it up? Let's go. Wait, was there actually? Yeah, there was. <gasps> this is actually clutch. Okay, now we can hop on the pig and use the carrot on a stick to lead it and wait a minute guys i might be able to reach that hopper over there if i make it to this corner oh it's like a maze and oh oh i made it all right let me check inside of this hopper real quick and oh guys there's a single iron trap door oh uh, awesome. What are we supposed to do with that? I have no idea. Oh, gosh. But hmm, this is one block that we could use. I guess should we put it down over here? We're one block of the way there. Wait, wait, wait. Don't put anything down yet. It's made of iron. Mm, guys, I'm pretty sure we just have to put this iron trap door down here. I don't know what else we're supposed to do. Okay, we'll put it down then. Yeah, I'm out of ideas. All right, I guess let's just put down the iron trap door. Hopefully this wasn't a mistake. We can't break it since it's iron, but... Hmm, okay, what do we do now? We're one block of the way there. Is there any other stuff in this room that we could use? Uh, I wish I could set myself on fire again. Oh, gosh, yeah. What if there's something behind the furnace? And, oh, wait a minute. You're right. We can break the furnace. Hold on, hold on. We gotta check behind the furnace. Let's 
see. Please don't be disappointing. Please actually be something. Come on, come on. Give us something good. At oh, wait. Is that, is that another furnace? It's another furnace, guys. Okay, well, hold on. Is there anything inside of this one? And oh, wait a minute, guys. There's two carpets in here. Wait, I'm pretty sure you can stack carpets on top of each other. Look, look, look. That's like a full block right there. Wait, what? We can use that to get up. Exactly. Hold on, hold on. Let me grab the carpets. There we go. And now wait, 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 we can wait, place wait, them. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, look, we need another block to get up there. Doing that will waste a block. We need to find something we can put the carpet on. And wait, wait, hold on. Let me try this out. Let me try this out. And okay, we can make it here, but oh gosh. Yeah, we can't like fully make it up. We need another block. We need one more block. Mm, okay, okay. Well, is there any other blocks in here that we could use? Uh, could you make any blocks out of a pig? No, I'm pretty sure you can't. Okay, then Gerard lives. Are there any hidden walls that we can go through? And ooh, yeah, good idea, good idea. Hold on. We gotta check for any hidden walls. Remember that first hacker training room, how there was a hidden wall? Maybe there's another one of those. Let's see. Um, I'm not seeing anything, but I'll keep looking. Wait, wait, guys, 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 something right here. We all just passed it. Look, there's a piece of string. Wait, what? Oh. I think I know what we have to do. Guys, if you have string, you could put carpet on top of it. Hold on. Someone hand me over the carpet. Who picked it up? Take that, take that. All right, all right. Thank you. And check it out now. If we can just put the string right over there like that and then put the carpet on top of it. And then we can place another carpet down here. Oh, wait, hold on. That, guys, that doesn't work. Yeah, we need to find another piece of string. Unless I can pick up this carpet from all the way up here. And oh, I don't think I can. Okay, yeah, we need another piece of string. Maybe there's another one somewhere around this room. That's gotta be it. Look around the room. All right, well, guys, everyone just keep looking. There's gotta be another piece of string somewhere here. It blends in super well with the bedrock, so you gotta keep a very careful eye out. <gasps> Wait, look up there. Wait, what? Do you see it? And oh, there's a piece of string right there. Hold on. That was not there before, guys. That's what that was not there before. Yeah, how are we supposed to get that? Um, okay, this is gonna be kind of tough. We have no way we have enough blocks to get all the way up there. Oh. Oh, yeah, you're not tall enough to reach that. And wait, guys, hold on. I have an idea. I'm pretty sure you can use fishing rods to, you know, uh, grab blocks. We have a carrot on a stick. Maybe we can turn this into a fishing rod. No, I'm pretty sure you can. If you just break it, it breaks. No, no, no. Here, I'll, I'll feed the carrot to Gerard. Gerard, can you eat this carrot and then turn it into a fishing rod real quick? And okay, Gerard's not eating it. Wait, do I, do any of you guys like carrots? No, I'm all right. No, I don't think we're going to find anything else in this room. We've checked every inch of it. Oh, my gosh. Well, then what are we going to do? I'm just going to ride Gerard. I'm going to stress out. Wait, I guess there's one spot we haven't checked. And what? Well, well, what spot have we not checked yet, Ruby? The maze. You're in it right now, silly. I already checked it and... Wait, I think I just stepped on a pressure plate. <gasps> it gave me a fishing rod. Guys, I have a fishing rod now. What did I just say? Oh my gosh. I was not expecting that to work. But wait, hold on, guys. We got to grab that piece of string before it despawns. Let me just fish my rod up over there. And oh, oh, I got it. Let's go. Oh, oh, there it is. Let's go. Now we have two pieces of string. I'm pretty sure now we should be able to make it all the way out. Let me just make my way up all the way over here. And all right, Cam, you got that other piece of carpet, right? Yep. Uh, I'll just place it right there. All right, now check it out. We can place the string here with the carpet on top. And and boom! There we go! We made it out. Let's go! Sweet! Finally! <gasps> There's a ladder. We can escape! <gasps> Let's go! Is this the end? Finally, we can get out of here! Come on, let me out! I see the light. And come on, we're almost at the top. And whoa, whoa, we just went through a block. That was pretty crazy. And oh, yes, you finally, we can meet you. Hey, what took you guys so long? What, what do you mean what took us so long? Did we not complete the puzzle in time? You were supposed to hack your way through the puzzle. Why did it take you so long? I've been waiting here forever. Oh, that makes a lot of sense. Wait, we were supposed to hack our way through the puzzle? Um, yes, so you could go on a date with me. What? Okay, well, how are we supposed to hack it? You didn't teach us how to do that. You were supposed to learn during the training. You were supposed to complete that under five minutes. What? Uh, how long did it take us? It took you like 52 minutes. That's it. I'm just gonna go away. And what? Oh, no. Okay, guys, I don't think the hacker girl really likes me anymore. Oh, uh, well, uh, I guess we could go back to the house. Um, that was awkward. Uh, GG's, I guess that relationship didn't last very long. Oh, gosh, yeah. Well, I don't know. I guess we weren't meant to be together anyways. I guess let's just head back home. Last one to the house has to eat Ruby's pickle. Oh, no. Okay, I'm not going last. Wait, what they're fine that was pretty crazy and if you want to watch the next video then click on the video on the screen right now